We've got an unboxing. Check this out. This is the Sofa Baton. It's a universal remote uh, from Amazon, or at least not made by Amazon, but sold on Amazon. It's called the Sofa Baton U1. And if you've ever seen the Logitech Harmony line of remotes, this will look somewhat familiar. There's no question there are some cues being taken from here. And with Harmony recently discontinuing its line of remotes, Sofa Baton uh, is a company that apparently is there to pick up the pieces. I got to give them two points for the name Sofa Baton. It's kind of clever, kind of funny at the same time. The Sofa Baton. So we'll take a look at the box here real quick. Uh, on the side, you've got your uh, your app icons. Obviously, they've got an app in the Apple Store and the Google Play Store. And then on the side here, supports multiple devices, complete IR code in the cloud, advanced OLED display, customizable macro key, customizable remote button, and again, supports mobile apps. So we've got some plastic, which I will use my fingernail to, to rip, as always. Let's not pretend I have some sort of fancy tool for that, because I don't. And we will open up the Sofa Baton. Let's check it out here. Da, 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 da. You see on the front of the box, by the way, it's got its number buttons, some color buttons, some play pause buttons there, your uh, normal navigation buttons, home button, menu button, a power button, and a cool little display and some sort of roller uh, button there near the top. So it all looks cool. Let's check it out. Got a user manual. Cool. If you read those, very cool. If not, you're like me. And here we go. Here it is, the Sofa Baton. Let's check it out. So it feels plasticky for sure. It feels like a plastic remote. If you've ever gotten one of those, uh, you know, any normal plastic remote, it doesn't have a heavy feel to it, although it's uh, probably sans batteries. Yep, it's got batteries right there. So uh, maybe once we add the batteries, it'll have a heavier feel. But, but for now, it definitely feels like a hollow plasticky remote. This thing goes for about 40 to 50 bucks on Amazon. You've got a couple of batteries there. Nothing's too interesting. Let's just pop this open. And that's it. The baton is pretty much all you get. So let's, uh, let's slice these batteries open and, and pop them in and see what happens. So unpackaged, I'm gonna set those aside for a second because I wanna show you this. So the battery compartment on the back does not slide open, of course, my first inclination was to kind of slide it open. And these batteries do not want to sit still. My first inclination was to slide it open and it doesn't do that. You sort of have to, you got these little notches on the side here. I don't love this, I'm not gonna lie. You just sort of pop it open. It's not hard, but it's almost counterintuitive for a remote control because we're so used to how normal remote controls work. All right, so you pop the batteries in like that. I will say putting it back on is fairly easy. You just kind of align up that little nub there and push it in and there we go the screen has illuminated uh, i like that cool little screen at the top now let's go through the buttons that we have here so as i mentioned the number buttons on the bottom this by the way is a plastic face here you've got your color-coded buttons that you've seen on a lot of remotes your, your normal play pause button these buttons are rubber they feel kind of like a normal remote do you hear that a little bit of a click to them which is kind of cool Good responsive feel. Uh, you've got a back button, your mute button, your normal directional controls, volume up, channel up, channel down. Uh, you've got your home button, what appears to be a menu button, some sort of info button. Uh, I'm not sure which that one does. This is a power button, but then you've got a TV power button on the top too. So that's interesting that you've got two power buttons. I'm not sure maybe this is the power button for the remote itself. Uh, maybe not, or maybe that's, we'll have to play with it because we got to connect it to the Sofa Baton app. So I hope to have more coming up, but I wanted to give you the initial look, the unboxing of the Sofa Baton U1 Universal Remote. Again, this is sold on Amazon. I've got a link for you if you want to check it out in the description below. And uh, look for another video coming up soon as I actually test out the Sofa Baton U1.